Hi guys, it's Bags and President Ross. Today we have an updated election map. Who do you guys want to win? Let us know in the comments. Also, like, share, and subscribe for more videos. We also have a poll posted on our community tabs of who you guys want to win the presidential election. Donald Trump or Kamala Harris, make sure you vote in that poll to make sure your vote is heard. Our source today is projects.538.com slash 2024-election.forecast-dash. Let's fill in that map based on their statistics. Washington State with 12 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. Oregon with 8 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. California with 54 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. Hawaii with 4 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. Alaska with 3 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Montana with 4 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Idaho with 4 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Wyoming with 3 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Nevada, according to that, Project 538 is a toss-up. It is not to be filled in. Utah, with six electoral votes, is red for Donald J. Trump. Arizona, according to 538 Project, is a toss-up, will not be colored in. Colorado, with 10 electoral votes, is blue for Kamala Harris. New Mexico, with five electoral votes, is blue for Kamala Harris. North Dakota, with three electoral votes, is red for Donald J. Trump. South Dakota with three electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Nebraska, the state, is red for Donald J. Trump. The first district is red for Donald J. Trump. And the second district is blue for Kamala Harris, making Nebraska at large red for Donald J. Trump. Kansas with six electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Oklahoma with seven electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Texas with 40 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Minnesota with 10 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris and Timothy Walls. Wisconsin and Michigan, according to Project 538, are toss-ups. They will not be colored in. Any candidate could potentially win these two toss-up states. Iowa with six electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Missouri with 10 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Arkansas with six electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Louisiana with eight electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Illinois with 19 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris and Timothy Walls. Indiana with 11 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Ohio with 17 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump and J.D. Vance. Hillbilly eulogy. West Virginia with 4 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Kentucky with 8 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Tennessee with 11 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Mississippi with 6 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Alabama with 9 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Florida with 30 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Georgia, according to Project538.com slash election map, is a toss-up, will not be colored in. South Carolina with 9 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. North Carolina with 16 electoral votes, according to Project 538, is a toss-up, it will not be colored in. Virginia with 13 electoral votes is light blue, two clicks for Kamala Harris and Timothy Walls. Pennsylvania with 19 electoral votes is a toss-up, according to our source, Project 538, it will not be colored in. New York with 28 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. Maine itself is red for Donald J. Trump. The second or first district of Maine is blue for Kamala Harris, and Maine at large is red for Donald J. Trump. Now go to blue. New Hampshire, Vermont, Connecticut, New Jersey, Massachusetts, Delaware, Rhode Island, Maryland, and D.C. are all blue for Kamala Harris. That puts Kamala Harris at 224 electoral votes and Donald J. Trump at 221. It's anyone's guess as to who could win this race. I'm President Ross. And I'm Bags. And we are out.